I'm actually super excited to introduce to you guys on the vlog because she also has a YouTube channel. And we always came to the spot where they had alpacas. And they're still here. <laughs> we decided to come down to the Coal Hills to have a picnic. My mom literally gave me the cutest little potted strawberry. Welcome back to our channel or welcome to it if you guys are new here we've had a few new subscribers lately so thank you so much for subscribing to our channel if you're watching this i appreciate you so much and i hope you enjoy our future content hello, hello. you are soaking wet i don't know what i don't know why i even bother dressing you at this point when you go outside because you just get wet in the pool or your water table or the mud pit you're welcome <laughs> I don't want you to pick the scabs on my arm, thank you. My arms are so cut up from the last video you guys saw of me doing a whole bunch of gardening, taking all those dead trees out, really scratched up my arms. Like, I don't know if you guys can tell anymore, but no, not really. You guys can't even really see them. It looks like nothing now, but I promise there's a bunch of little scabs all over my arms. They're my warrior scars from gardening. Ah, yeah. You just, I just started talking. You just sit right down in front of me. This is so cute. <laughs> You're adorable. I actually woke up decently early this morning while Chris was getting ready for work um, because Skylar May has been waking up early as well. Yes. And then pretty much just made myself a coffee and hung out for a bit and decided to edit our May Day long weekend video. And that was a big one to edit. I actually wasn't even planning on vlogging today, but I just decided, you know what, I'm gonna pick up the camera and just kind of go with the flow. There's no rhyme or reason to it, so I don't know what we're getting up to today. One of my friends is also supposed to be coming over later, or we're supposed to be going to do something and hanging out at some point um, this evening when she gets off of work. We might go for a walk somewhere, I'm not really sure, but I'll bring you guys along if we end up doing that. And yeah, kind of just go with the freaking flow. Um, during the last vlog when I was gardening at my parents' house, this lens that I've been using on my Sony ZV-1 for quite some time now, pretty much since I got the camera, um, I got this lens quickly after I got the camera and I've been using it ever since. Um, but if you guys have been watching the vlogs for a while, you know that at Skylar May's third birthday party in November, my camera <laughs> had an incident where it totally bailed off of the table and broke. Luckily, obviously, I was very thankful to have it fixed, but ever since that happened and this lens came off of the end of the camera, it has never, um, quite stuck to it the same. Ever. And I don't know if you guys will be able to see. That rainbow hue showed up after the incident with my camera and um, I didn't think that it was gonna make much of a difference when filming, but ever since it happened, some vlogs that I edit, when this lens hit a certain light, you can totally see the flare and the rainbow, which hasn't really bothered me. When I was doing all the gardening at my parents' house, it fell off because the adhesive has not been super well ever since it fell off of my camera in the first place. Um, so honestly, I've just been, so I vlogged the remainder of that video without this lens on it after that point. And obviously I'm vlogging without it right now. And I have noticed the difference a titch. So this is a wide angle lens, but it's also a macro 52 millimeter lens as well. But I have to check the package and see if there's more like adhesive pieces to use to stick it back on to see if that would work. Um, and if it doesn't, honestly, it's not a huge deal to me, like I said videotaping right now, I don't notice a huge difference. You can't have that. <laughs> um, but I do love using the lens, um, especially for close-ups and wide angles, specifically, because that's what it is. Um, so I would eventually like to get a replacement for it and get a new one. It wasn't super expensive and Chris got me it for a birthday gift. So honestly, I could spend the extra money um, in a little bit when I decide that I want to get a new one. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much for the lovin'. Sorry. Why are you sorry? What did you do? <laughs> I was at Walmart the other night and I got this little, I don't even know what to call it. I guess it's like a, 
It's like a rectangle flower bed. I'll show you it in a second, but I picked it up for like 20 bucks at Walmart last night. And uh, I also picked up a couple of herbs. I really wanted to find basil, but I could not find some that had already been like, kind of like starting to grow um, and potted. So I bought basil seeds. I also got dill seeds. And then I got actual little baby plants of cilantro and parsley. And I'm going to kind of put the planter like half into my um, flower bed that I kind of redid in the last video. If you guys haven't seen that yet, go and check it out because it was such a huge transformation and I've been obsessed with hanging out outside because I just love looking at my flower bed now. <laughs> um, I've also been obsessed with gardening as well. I've been going into the gardening sections um, ever since this whole hobby started. I've been going into... Thank you. You're moving my hair out of my face for me. That's so nice of you. You're so sweet. So I think I'm gonna go put that little herb bed into my flower bed and then put some dirt in it and plant my little herbies and you guys can plant them with me because that's what we're doing on this channel now. So I really hope you enjoy watching um, gardening and stuff like that because that's, it's probably gonna be incorporated into like every other vlog. <laughs> this friend that I'm hanging out later with too. I'm actually super excited to introduce to you guys on the vlog because she also has a YouTube channel and often um, does vlogs, like mom, mom style vlogs and um, some story time, stuff like that, uh, just like, just like we do on this channel, very similar content. Um, and me and her have been friends since high school, so I don't know why I've literally never had her in a video before, not even on my old channel. Probably because we made other content on a different private channel but never shared it because it was just a hobby of ours. And you know what, I'm not even gonna talk about it because it's highly embarrassing and you don't need to know. But I'm excited to have her on the vlog later. Okay, so I don't know if I showed you guys this either, but I picked up some lavender when I was at Quality Foods the other day. French lavender, to be exact. And I planted that over here the other day. And then this is like the, the I don't even want to call it a pot. Because I feel like pots are round. Flower bed? I don't know. <laughs> you guys can tell me in the comments below. Um, and then we got our cilantro. It's looking a little sad right now because it's super freaking dry. So I need to plant this stuff, give it some water as well as the parsley. And then we have dill seeds and basil yeah. seeds. I really don't know if it's the right time to be planting these right now or if it's too late. But we're going to plant them and we're going to try. It's all experimental because I'm, I'm new to this sort of thing. So I think I'm going to put it right here as well, just like a little bit over. So I'll kind of dig out a spot for it put it in there and then fill it in with the dirt that I used to dig out the spot for it. And then we can water all of our babies. So everything's probably pretty dry. Actually, you know what? The strawberries are still a little bit damp as well. As the tomatoes. Yeah, the tomatoes definitely don't need to be watered. Oh, they're growing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why didn't I notice that until just now? Nothing's growing on the strawberries though. I don't think. Maybe the leaves have gotten a little bit taller. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna pot these suckers before they die.
I need a lot more soil. I didn't have enough, whether or not I didn't dig a deep enough hole for it to go into um, or not. But I do like, you know, the amount that it's in there. But I definitely need more soil. I want to get more soil to kind of cover this whole area as well. I thought that bag that we got last time would have been more than enough, but here we are. <laughs> so I have to get more, more soil and then I can top up these guys. But I planted the dill here and the basil here. And then we have our cilantro and our parsley. Um, some a little herb garden, so cute. I absolutely freaking love it. And it just makes me so happy. But me and Skylar May are just gonna hang out and enjoy the sunshine for a little bit. I think I'm gonna make myself something to eat because I've only had a croissant this morning and I'm a bit peckish. Skylar May is probably peckish too, so I'm gonna make us some lunch and then I'll pick the vlog back up when we get up to something. This feel awkward. <laughs> I can shut it off. No. <laughs> this is Paisley. This is my friend that I was talking about earlier. Hi. We're gonna go for a walk somewhere. We're gonna go walk it up. Yeah, somewhere that we used to go all the time. How long has it been? Since we've done that. Oh, like, I don't probably, like, even know. Was it grade... Did we go in grade 12? I don't think so. It was probably grade like 10. grade 10, honestly. And we've almost been graduated for 10 years now. <laughs> so. Yeah, yikes. That long. <laughs> <laughs> now we were dorks. We used to go for walks. <laughs> Kids yeah. now just... We had a routine. We did. Tea, walk, come back. Build Forts. a fort, make <laughs> Try nachos, to watch a horrible movie. <laughs> Try to watch a horrible movie. <laughs> made it down the main road that we always come down. I don't even know the name of this road, which is really funny the amount of times that we've walked down it. <laughs> I don't know names of any roads. Um, and we always came to the spot where they had alpacas. And they're still here, but they can't come up to the fence. Oh, like shaved and the other one just the oh my God. Yeah, they, they down would there. come like literally right here. Yeah, they would come right up to the fence and say hi to us. Hello, little one. He's looking at us. He remembers. Yeah, it's probably not the same. that one looks like oh, it just got shaved for sure. Yeah. Oh my god! For? But we have like old crappy photos that we've taken on our old them. phones. <laughs> I should try and find them. They're on my old laptop though. And they used to come right up here. We used to be able to pet them, which is sad. But I can't believe they're still there. That's actually awesome. That's so cool. It's been so long. <laughs> Just walking down this gorgeous freaking road. It's on the way to Bevan. The trees are absolutely beautiful. <laughs> um, but we always used to we always used to walk down here, and I don't even know if it was like an old mining shack or what that it was, was used for. But it's called Drax Castle, and it's basically kind of like I've taken you the vlog to Bevan before, so you guys know like those old kind of stone ruins. There's only just one spot, but there, it's called Drax Castle. All the all the cool kids used to come here <laughs> back in the day, and I think so. a lot of teenagers still do, I hope to be honest. <laughs> but um, so that's that's where we're going, and that's probably I think we're approaching it because it used to be right after this yes. yellow gate. So. Paisley's place to get some stuff because she's gonna spend the night tonight. We're gonna have a girls night, but this is the trailer that she 
currently is not living in. I won't, I'll spare you the details, but it's so surreal to me because I watch her vlogs all the time in this trailer and now I'm standing in it. I feel like I'm having a fangirl moment, but this is such a cute freaking trailer. So freaking cute. Anyways, moving on. We're going to go um, into town and get something to eat, some food, and then go back home and probably just chill out for a little bit. So honestly, I'm probably not gonna vlog too, too much of the rest of our night tonight. And I'll probably just end, and I'll probably just vlog a little bit of our day tomorrow um, and do like another weekend vlog. I don't know what we'll get up to. I never really know when I start these vlogs, but. I can't remember. But they're back now. Come here. Oh. It is the following Sunday and we just came to my mom and dad's. Chris really wanted to put a couple coats of varnish on his cornhole boards and they look so freaking good with the clear coat on them. I'll show you guys those in a second. Yeah, so we're just hanging out. Skylar's been walking around the yard picking all her little wishes. All the flowers are blooming in my parents' yard. All their roses and everything and everything just looks so freaking cute. There's little blue forget-me-nots everywhere as well. I absolutely love all the colors of springtime. decided to come down to the Coal Hills to have a picnic. We've brought in the vlog here once before for a picnic. I think it was the year before last. It might have been last year, but it is just such a beautiful day outside and Chris finished varnishing up his boards. He left them at my mom and dad's house to dry overnight, but we have just come to the Coal Hills. Um, we're in a different spot this time, but we got some snacks and stuff. Skylar's just munching on a little cookie. Actually, it's a big cookie. I'm just gonna mow this cheese bun, turkey and cheese sandwich. And then we got some sausage rolls, some cookies, some chips, and Chris is having a wrap. That looks bomb. It's not bad. It's not bad. What's in it? Mm -hmm. It's spicy? Uh, it's probably Chipotle or something like that.
literally gave me the cutest little potted strawberry the other night when me and Paisley were there. We um, parked the truck in their yard so that we could walk from their house. My mom was like, wait, I have something for you and gave me this adorable little strawberry in this old purple watering can and it is just the cutest freaking thing ever. And there's already a teeny tiny strawberry ready to come. That is so stinking cute. Also, we have a super exciting update um, of a milestone that Skylar Mae has finally passed after so long. She has finally went from being into diapers to pull-ups and we are so freaking pumped for her. She was absolutely hating her diapers. She would literally rip them off of her every two freaking seconds. So the potty train is moving along and now our big girl's in pull-ups. But I cannot believe how big she's getting. She is literally getting so tall and so big and oh my god, if I start to think about it, I get emotional. But she is just getting so freaking big. I can't believe she's in pull-ups and not in diapers anymore. It's actually kind of sad because you think about, you know, when, when you had them in those little tiny newborn diapers. Anyways, I'm probably just being weird. <laughs> if you're a mom, you know. Also, do you remember when at the beginning of this vlog, um, when I was talking to you guys about my, how my lens fell off and how it didn't matter and I wasn't gonna use it because I didn't really notice a huge different vlogging without it? Well, I lied because last night when me and Paisley were going on our adventure and our walk, I was trying to vlog holding the camera in my hand and let me tell you, I noticed the freaking difference because I was holding it as far away from me as I can and I still felt like it was super zoomed in on my face, which I absolutely hated, which is why I didn't vlog a whole bunch on our walk, which sucked because it was just making me angry every time I attempted to. I don't even, like the footage that I might have got literally might just be of my chin because I'm so used to it being more um, of a broad spectrum. So I looked in the box that I got it and I had one more adhesive piece of tape um, that I could use. So I used it and I, the lens is back on my camera and I could not be happier. Hopefully it sticks and if this one falls off, I'm gonna have to get a new lens or see if I can find the same little adhesive circle sticky thing so they're the right size um, so that I can keep using it because I definitely noticed a difference. I guess I didn't notice a difference before because I usually just like set my camera down like I have right now and like sit away from it and talk to you guys because um, I don't like holding it if I don't have to, but I definitely noticed when I was trying to vlog and walk at the same time. Um, it was it was not happening <laughs> But I think I'm gonna take this opportunity to end the vlog for today So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for more content Like this in the future and until then I will see you guys in the next one. Bye